Hello everybody, my name is Big Omar of OTR Gaming TV and welcome to my channel today. Today I'm going to be talking to you about the latest instalment coming up tomorrow, which is 12th of July 2016 for GTA 5 Online, which is called Cunning Stunts. And why? where do I even begin with this? It's just, it's crazy. I wanted to make a video for a couple of days now, but I've noticed a lot more content's been coming out. People are spotting more stuff, you know, I'm trying to compile a bit of information together to give you guys so we can just you know kind of have a heads up of what's trying to come out tomorrow and what may be coming out tomorrow so here we go yeah first of all god supercars i heard there's going to be some new supercars and i mean wow have you seen these cars people come on these cars are Shit. amazing i thought the x80 proto was good but damn these are based on the man's cars and they're based on the old audis and the bloody Lancia Stratus, I mean, come on, are you having a joke, GTA? They think it's a joke, I can tell you that now, because I've just spent like 10, 15 million buying my bloody organisation and my garages and my bloody everything that comes with it. <clears throat> then I bought his three cars, which were, okay, I, I give them that, those okay, the FMJ, X80 Proto and the, was it, Gratti Bestia, yeah, Bestia, whatever it's called, I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong, but... This is going to be a very expensive update. I mean, cars, supercars, sports cars, motorbikes. There's going to be helmets coming out. There's going to be different, you know, variety of clothes, racing style clothes, motocross style clothes. There's going to be different libraries for cars. I don't know if they're going to bring out new cars where it's going to be a whole different category of car. You have to buy it, customize it, go from there. I mean, it's absolutely crazy. I mean, some of these cars you see, I mean, as you can see, one looks like a Audi, old Audi S1 Pikes Peaks version, Audi Quattro, the rally car. And I mean, come on, that's just absolutely beautiful. Obey, as you know, is based on <coughs> uh, Audis, but yeah, you can go from there and take it for yourself. I don't know, it's just, if you look at the car, it looks beast. And with all the different libraries you can put on it, I've seen a different couple of styles in the video that Rockstar released, their official trailer, and they look absolutely amazing. See, at first, the next car that's going to come up, like, obviously, is a Le Mans car. I thought, personally, yeah, it looked like a Celine, because the way I looked at the front, the Celine S7, but I corrected myself on that. It does look like a Le Mans, why is it, endurance car, 24-hour Le Mans car, stuff like that. I mean, just look at it, it's absolutely amazing. Another car they said is coming out is a little Fiat 500 lookalike. I mean, it does look like a bit of a smart car, a bit of a Fiat 500. It's probably good for the little bumper car races, like when they've done the sumo mode and the sumo adversary mode where you could have bumper cars. Probably incorporate something like that, <clears throat> which is, I think, absolutely amazing. I like the sumos. Some per uh, An actual GTA player made that first. Rockstar actually copied a GTA player, but pff, it was just called um, Bumper Cars. I don't know if you like played it. I know. I mean, leave me a comment. Leave me a you know, a little message just to say you did. Cause I know I did. It was wicked. Everything about it was wicked. Me and my friends played that numerous times. There were so many different maps you could play on it. It was actually really really good. But yeah, I mean, this car. I don't even know where to start. If the X80 Proto was two point something mil, I mean, this is going to be pushing it at least in the three mil region. That's my personal estimate on what it might be. But. You know, I could be corrected, I could be wrong. People might already know information, you never know. But yeah, the next car that's going to come up, it looks like a Lancia Stratus, I think. People are saying it looks like a, a Porsche 911 from back in the day, the rally car version, but... You know, but Rockstar like to mess around a bit and they like to put a bit of different cars here and there and mix and match, so you never know. You know, we both could be right, we both could be wrong, you, you never know. But it is a nice car, as you can see, there's a comparison of... I don't know, it's, it, it's just, yeah, it's a nice car. I'm dreading to think how much all this is going to cost. I mean, I, most of the people who play GTA, the GTA community knows it's hard to make money in the game. And if you don't mod and you don't oh. glitch and you don't do stuff like that and you actually play it legit like some of us actually do, it's very hard to make money. I remember when my yacht came out, I had to scrimp and save and I've, I've done hot over and over again. And it's just, sometimes it's unfair because you make all that money, you save it, you're so tempted to buy stuff, and then next thing you know, boom, 10 mil on a yacht, 30, yeah. But, can't complain, it's all part, part of the game, it's, it's all what we want, so, you know. But yeah, there's some of the cars I've seen, and there's some bikes, I mean, there's some really nice bikes coming out. I think there's going to be about five or six bikes at least coming out. 
I have no idea what they look like or how they are. And, you know, the, there's comparisons up to them, but I'm not really a bike fan. I'm not gonna lie. I did see there was a Mustang looking car that's kind of based on the Ken Block drift car, which, oh my God, you know, again, the sound, the power, it's gonna be wicked. There's all different stuff. I mean, the races they're bringing out in here, the races are absolutely amazing, sky high races with big jumps, you know, insane crazy jumps. You got loop de loops, you got boost incorporated in the tunnels. It's all around the top of May's uh, bank. It's all around the actual top of Los, Los Santos, to be fair. And it, it just looks absolutely amazing. I mean, I, I take my hat off to Rockstar on this one. If the hype is there and what they're saying is going to be true and all this is coming out, then yeah man it looks like it's going to be one of their biggest updates to date and they brought out quite a bit in this i mean <clears throat> separating the cars over the last update i mean i'm not too sure why they did that maybe they wanted to just linger it out a bit more for this i don't know if they're going to bring all the cars out in this if they're going to bring certain cars out this week maybe next week just to drag this one out you never know you know what i mean but it's coming out tomorrow i know that and it looks like it's going to be amazing. I was watching the trailer myself, and as soon as Rockstar put the trailer up on Instagram, I was straight there, Instagram, boom, watching it. And just, yeah, you can hit me up on Instagram, OTR Gamer TV, and that's how we do it. <clears throat> it's just everything you could think of that you actually want in GTA looks like it's coming out now. And, you know, fair play to GTA. You know, everything they do, obviously they do for us. They don't really take much of our consideration and much of our word into consideration i know they don't certain things they do certain things they don't but you know i heard there's two off-road rally car uh, rally car lookalikes which look like dakar rally cars you know bobcats from back in the day which i think are absolutely wicked you know i, I did like playing with them on a different game called the crew similar sort of car that they've put into this game and incorporated in it looks wicked it looks fast i can imagine that banging into something and it goes flying you know and it's just yeah man like I said, nice I heard there's helmets though. coming out, there may be new hats coming out, you know, they're saying, some people are saying it's based on the Hot Wheels, some people are saying it's based on the Track Mania games, I mean, whatever man, whatever floats your boat, whatever you think it is, it is, but, you know, I personally think it's going to be a really good update, I've, I'm trying my best to make as much money as I can right now, just so i got stuff to do, I mean, I've seen one race, and it, it's like temping bowling, it's got skittles in the race and you got to hit the skittles out there. I mean, come on Rockstar, you're getting a bit creative there. But, loop-de-loops and tubes and daredevil races and, you know, these cars are super, super fast. They look like they're going to be super fast. I'm hoping the Le Mans looking cars are very, very fast. And if they beat the X80 Proto, then yeah, they're worth the money. If they're not, they're not. If you check out some of my previous videos, I did say that... The X80 is the fastest car, so yeah, it's worth the money. If it's not going to be a fast car, and it's going to be slow. I mean, the Fista 811, personally, I sold mine. Why? I didn't like it. It was crap. For the money I paid for it, it's a waste of money. And I don't like the fact that I'll spend all that money, like one point God knows how much mil, and only get like 800,000 back. Where's the rest of my money? That's like, you know, I, I earned that. Rockstar shouldn't be taking that. They shouldn't be taking take that into consideration and refund people back their money but yeah sorry rant over people i don't know if you'll be able to take these cars into benny's maybe they're all going to be los santos custom cars you never know but if they are, some of them are benny's cars then whoa people viewers listeners friends i'm telling you now you need to save your money because it's coming out sometime tomorrow i did make this video like like i said i did want to make this video a couple of weeks a couple of days back and i heard about this the date come out like 34 minutes after rockstar put their official trailer out i knew about it started checking it out and obviously other youtubers i've been watching and they've been just saying that you know this is coming that's coming i've compiled a bit together and yeah i mean as far as i'm concerned this is going to be a really big update i reckon i hope they don't like drag it out but then i kind of do because if they do drag it out a bit then maybe you'll give us more time to make a bit of money to purchase more cars i know next week another car's coming out so i've got a whole week to do some races do some death matches do some of the power play you know everything like that and then save and accumulate and do some heists and hopefully get some extra cash in but you know i would never purchase a shark card ever 
I'm fortunate enough to have really good friends on this game and they always help me out with money and you know whatnot and yeah we just do heists all the time and that's the best way wasting extra money for shark cards is just absolutely disgraceful I'll be honest with you but hey each to their own and if you're gonna pay god knows how much what for three and a half million dollars I mean come on that's just absolutely stupid but yeah just as you can see it's an amazing looking update and I can't wait to see I'm really excited I'm actually gonna leave my PlayStation on all night so it can just update itself whenever it does tomorrow I'm gonna come on from work and absolutely destroy it there will be future videos on this cunning stunts update and there will be plenty of comparison videos with the races with the cars with the bikes with everything I mean some of us in team double R we have quite a bit of money so we're gonna purchase everything make some videos and hopefully show you guys exactly what you need to see and exactly what you want and yeah if you like comment subscribe on my channel that would be absolutely perfect and i look forward to seeing you guys soon i'll chat to you lot soon peace out this is big omar of otr gamer tv peace